storm damage. Last night's powerful storms left behind downed trees and even some power outages. Folks waking up without waking up without electricity this morning. NBC 5's Michelle Welford live in Edgewater on the north side with the situation there this morning. Michelle. Well, Stefan, unfortunately, a number of neighborhoods this morning looking a bit like this one. You can see a lot of debris here in the street. There's a large limb down. We did see a Department of Transportation crew out here this morning, and they were repairing a, a damaged street lamp, and uh, they saw a power line was kind of hanging a bit, so they were able to take care of that. But this is uh, Lakewood Avenue here in Edgewater, and a number of neighbors waking up this morning and telling me, you know, they're really surprised to see so much damage throughout the city. The strong storms knocked down utility poles and downpours sent people running for cover. And Wrigley weather postponed the Cubs games as fans grabbed ponchos and umbrellas to wait it out throughout the day. There was a tornado launch in effect for the entire Chicago area. That lasted until about 10 last night. It was a scary night for folks like Andrea Glass, who works at Aurora Rush Copley Medical Center. So Ugh. we are calling code black, which just means um, shut all the windows and doors, and if it got upgraded, move patients in the hallway. When we were coming out of work, the trees were like blowing over. So we said, we'll wait it out, see how it goes, and then I just got a weather alert in my car. So. Like, yeah, I better head home. And we're going to come back live now to Edgewater, and you can see, you know, a lot of cleaning up for people to do here in this neighborhood. It's nice to get a break from the rain so that they can get that done. And uh, some good news from ComEd this morning. They say 300 people, our uh, customers, I should say, are still without power. At the height of that storm, the number was closer to 17,000. Stefan ends it right wow. out to you. All right, Michelle, they have a lot of work to do. Thank you very much. Download the NBC Chicago app to see storm photos, tracks.